In this video I'm showing the easiest way to reset a password in Windows 10. Just to give an example of the issue I'm solving, if you're at the Windows 10 sign-in screen here and you enter a password, it will say the password is incorrect, try again, and no matter which password you try, it will keep giving you this screen. The main thing that you'll need to solve this problem is the Windows 10 Repair DVD, and if you're on a laptop, you'll need to have these files copied to a bootable USB drive. In this demonstration, I'm using a desktop, so I'm just going to insert the DVD into my disk drive, and then click on Restart. Then at the boot option screen here, I want to hit escape for the boot menu and then select CD-ROM drive and hit enter and then press any key. At this screen, just say no and then click on next. Click on repair your computer. Click on troubleshoot. Click on command prompt. And at the command prompt, type in exactly this command. I'll also put this in the comments to make it easier to follow. Type in move d colon backslash windows backslash system32 backslash utilman.exe space d colon backslash windows backslash system32 backslash utilman.exe.bak and then hit enter. Then type copy d colon backslash windows backslash system32 backslash cmd.exe to d colon backslash windows backslash system32 backslash utilman.exe. So the end result of running these commands is that we're tricking windows into using cmd.exe when it thinks it's using utilman.exe. It's not really important to understand and it'll kind of make more sense in the next screen. So right here, just type in WPE util space reboot, and that'll reboot your computer. All right, so now that we're back at the Windows 10 login screen here, we're gonna click on this little icon down in the bottom corner. What this would normally do is open up the Ease of Access Center, but the commands that we ran have replaced the file that this uses with CMD. So whenever we click on it, it opens up the command prompt window. So the command that we wanna run here is net space user space and then the username in my case it's fix files and then type in the new password in this case i'm just going to use password all lowercase and then hit enter and it'll say the command completed successfully and i'm going to go back to the login prompt here and type in password just like that and then hit enter and away we go all right, so this completes the tutorial. Hopefully at this point you were able to successfully reset the password and break into Windows. Hit the like button if this video was helpful. And thanks for viewing.